Anyways, let's go straight into Barry's episode of Resident Revelations 2, Episode 3. Next. Moira, what have you done with her? It was Alex Wesker. She's responsible for the experiment six months ago. They called her the Overseer. She took Moira away from me. And now I'll never get... And all for fucking what? I'm sorry. It's okay. She said she was going to be reborn. Reborn how? With a virus? Why did she need my little girl? Doesn't make any sense. I'm sorry. I can't remember anything else. <sighs> oh, sweetie, I'm sorry. It's my problem, not yours. Just take it easy. I was just thinking about how I used to go for walks like this with Moira and Polly. Were you a good family? <laughs> we tried to be. Moira and I fought a lot. Even after she grew up. Was it because she used bad words? <laughs> no. 
She just did that to tick me off. I'm the one that drove us apart. I messed up real bad as a father. She and Polly were playing in the house. I forgot to lock up my guns. And Moira, she... Polly had an accident. Was it Moira's fault? No. It was mine. But I raised my voice at her and... I guess I never really got around to taking the blame. Polly survived, thank God. But not me and Moira. We started drifting apart. I think she still loved you. I appreciate you saying that. I'll tell you this much. I couldn't save her, but I'm gonna save you. I promise I'll get you off this island. I know. Thanks, Barry. I asked to show you what that box was for earlier. This is where we were earlier. Just okay. now. I can walk now. All right, partner. Down you go. I'm happy that Polly lived, but I was right with my guess. That was a cute little moment, though. But the sewers have drained, so the box I left earlier is not going to be useful. Calling it. I was kind of thinking, I, was like, huh, I wonder if maybe since I dropped it down to the two of them, maybe now I can take advantage of the box here. We'll find out, though. I'm not sure, cloth. I never really used these, but... Hang and ammunition, which I'll hand over to Barry. Wait, do I hear what I think I hear? No, it's just one of those flying things, not an enemy. Alright. Or just chemical, but no bottles. At least so far. So they're going reverse through the level, apparently. Since we're starting here and we're making our way back right now. Things look a little bit more in disrepair. I also have to say that the uh, mutated, whatever the, I guess she's mutated, uh, Alex Wesker actually looks a lot more frightening. I mean, she looked creepy last episode, but they did a good job at continuing her creepiness here, surprisingly enough. Combine that. Smokescreen bottle. Let's see. I'm going to go for explosive for the moment. Transfer that over to Barry. Okay, and Alex Wesker's gender was kept ambiguous, and uh, Alex Wesker's reveal was at the end of episode two. Of course, now we know Alex Wesker is the main big baddie all here and up. Alex does what Alex Wesker does. Okay, nothing else to really point out. Enemy showing up though. Oh good, Wesker learned how to turn off his light. Not Wesker, fucking sorry, I'm thinking about Alex Wesker right now. Uh, Barry learned how to turn off his light. I have to say, I really like how they handled both Claire and Barry in this game, personally speaking. Alright. Yeah, there's bodies here. Let's see how many of them we can bypass. Is there any bricks nearby? I've decided I'm not really going for collectibles, so I'm not going to really go out of my way for the insects and all that. I kind of just want... I've gained invested into the story, oh. so I kind of want to see what happens. I will, of course, look around as I always do. I'm just not expecting to find everything. I already have a lot of emblems to go back and get. How are we gonna get back to the surface? With a lot of effort, but we can do it. Let me go get that brick. Will I be all sneaky, sneaky? The brick is my friend. Negatory captain. These are just regular rod. I can knife eat that. Yep, they're easy enough to knife since they're just the rotting type of enemy. Nothing else? Yeah, yeah. Let's go off to the top to see what we can see. Point this out. 
Oh, I already pointed it out. Never mind. We are starting. Perry scenario ended off with some really hard challenges last time. I almost had absolutely no ammo, so we just have to work with him. He's already spotted us. I'm a brick. It's just rotten, though. So I should just knife them. I expected to get hit there, but it's okay. Barry's got this. <laughs> Barry. Anyways, there's at least one more enemy that we can take care of, and he's that great. But it's probably just another rotten. So didn't want to get grabbed. But I want a knife. Not any safer down here. You okay? Yeah. Are you? Yeah, it looks like it. Let's keep on going. Things are a lot more quiet on their part. Here's the part where I think I can use the box. How many enemies are there? One of those. Oh, no wonder it's those insect things. I really like to make little squeaky sounds. That just happens. I guess they're dead. Not enough to take care of a few zombies at the very least. Not what I meant to do, but I do know what I need to do with this. I'll do it right now. Heal with the one herb we have. Don't want to waste it so soon, but I need to sort of in this instance. Not after Natalia, please. Okay, this could have gone much better, could have gone much worse. And indeed, that's what this box was for. We drop it as the two of them, so then we can go up here and pick up the stuff. So now I don't feel as bad for missing it earlier. I was really trying to figure that out, but now it makes a lot more sense. Hearts, I just pick up a red herb. I just pick up a red herb. Oh, that's so great if it's true. A ripple in time. I don't know what that achievement's about. Obtain the item that lies beyond the gate of the sewers and berries so oh, oh boy. Also, yep, red herb, and I got green herb, I'm gonna be better off, that's for certain. Let's go over here. Oh, speak of the devil. Combine these two. Pass one over to Natalia and we're a okay. spider. Well, that's fine. You're alive. Fun. Back to Natalia, because I just almost forgot that she can point things out. I do want that brick also. <laughs> Gotta go on bug squishing duty. There's the last of the insects. Come over here. I will squash you. Eliminate you. There's an Natalia challenge every episode to kill, to hit like 15 enemies with bricks, and I guess it's easier if it's just these little bug things. Come here, little bug things. I'm gonna hit you with a brick. That's part of the fun. That should be you, because I can see things. Point things out because I'm a pointing master. Only I am the master of pointing. Is that there? I can I crawl in there? Looks like I probably could have really put my mind to it. Okay, Barry. There is a gun there. It almost looks like a Chicago typewriter. There's no way we're not getting that. I have to point it out. What am I 
do to raise the gates. This hole looks like what you would expect, but yeah. So much to see. Maybe there's something a little bit deeper in here. There is that old man's control station we never take it, took advantage of, so. I'm gonna try that in a moment once I'm done with some of this stuff. Rifle ammo. That's fine with me. Is this box stuff here gone? I should have a metallic. She can point things out right. And she's pretty okay at climbing things that are like twice her height. When I was a kid, I'd have difficulty doing that, but apparently she's all so pro-skilled. Alright, yep, things seem fine. This is a lot more quiet time on their part, which is fine. There also seems to be infinite armies of bugs coming, but that's alright again. There's where Barry was. I think we're going this way. I might be mistaken, this might be the area that we just came. I think it's the area, yeah, this is the area we just came from. Sorry, Barry! Stay there! Gotcha. Come with me! Coming! Yeah, you're having some real difficulty, aren't you? You'll figure this out. Here you go, Barry. <clears throat> Can I check up here? Yes. There's also a shiny there. It's rifle ammo. Pass that on to you. How's the yeah, speaking of which, how are your weapons doing? Get some ammo with that. Reload the few clips for that. Getting rifle ammo, but I don't think you have a rifle. <laughs> that means we should probably go get one. I think there was a rifle I missed in Barry's first chapter, because I've heard people say there's a rifle in it. It's getting closer! Fuck. More you have a rifle. Fuck. It's getting closer. Shoot quickly. Ah, uh, okay, that was close. I do have a rifle. I don't know how I forgot about it. Those things will, if they get to you, will one hit kill you. So that's always part of the fun. We already got that. Oh, that's a chemical. Yeah, sure, I'll pick it up. We already got that in the other campaign, so we don't need it again. I'm thinking that maybe the old man's area here, because he can't still be alive. This is six months later. He's, like, dead now or something. Oh, he's dead on his bed. That's actually... That made me a little bit sad. <laughs> Empty bottle. See. Yeah. Leave him be. Poor man. He died all alone. Wait. This is Moira's. Island for what it did to her. Oh my, Barry. Let me pick this. Hey, chickens and rabbits and rats. We can eat all that, you know. And are those, are those eyeballs? I'm not gonna think about it. Mmm, delectable. I picked up a few things. Is one of us gonna empty? Yeah, I did. Combine with that. Let's make firebomb bottle. Pass that around. This is a diary. The Old Man Journal, 1998, September 19th. I need to practice my English, so I write in this journal on every day. Every day I write but have no words. Now I have good reason. Today I welcome first child to the world. Her mother give her the name 
Irina. It was my grandmother's name. I object, but I cannot win against stubborn woman. She has eyes and nose for her, of her father, but nose of her mother. We will raise her to be healthy and strong girl. This year island is have good spirits again. Mining business goes well. My life is pretty good for me now. I want to give Irina some uh, same feeling when she is older. It's my responsibility now as parent. The okay. Irina already six years old. How flies time. She loves to imitate her mother. Her mother hates it. Probably because imitation is perfect. Or yeah, imitation is perfect. Lu Kroshka is very smart. She likes math. Her grandmother likes math too. Irina's smile helps to take mind off worries. The mines have become dangerous, and now they make no money. Island condition is worster and worster. I have, uh, I might have lo uh, Lou's job too, but this is no time for a worry. This island is our home. I want to give it to little Kroshka in good condition. It's my responsibility now as parent. 2000s, or good old July 19th. Arena, now 12 years old, already rebellious, more like mother every day. I don't understand women. Now I embarrass to her, until she needs money or a request. <clears throat> Speaking of woman and money, a woman comes to our island. She promises to bring back industry. I have job now, to help build new facility in the mine. I thought mine was finished, but she has a use for it. She is loved by all. They call her savior, our benefactor. My mother always said never trust people with money. The poor worker is more reliable than rich capitalist. It's good advice, but the rich woman is helping us. 2008, July 19th. It is Arena's 20th birthday today. I should be celebrating, but I'm worried. Next week, she will go work in mines. I was against it, but Kroshka will not listen to me. He has not listened for years. Why start now? Arena is stubborn, just like her father. She used to always say, I guess she was right. Has it already been a year since you left us, my darling? I don't trust the people in the facility. There's something wrong about them, but everyone else thinks me stubborn old man. Maybe now Arena too, but I know I'm right. I just hope Arena will realize this too soon. 2009, September 19th. I have not seen Arena in almost one year. Something bad is happening to our home. People become sick. More things I cannot explain. I know it's all because of that woman. She smells of evil. This was to become Arena's home, but too late now. I leave this town, everything. But Island is my home. I will not leave. No place to go. So I go to sewers. I stay here. Things will get worse. I know it. Arena, be safe. I will find you. I promise Krashka. You are all your father have left. Ripped onto a ruby until his last moments alive. Oh my. Let's so. get out of here first. Stay close, okay? I will. Firing rates. Might as well, I guess. I should probably put a weapon away because I'm probably going to find a new weapon. Uh, what do I not need? What do I have the least ammo for? I'm probably not going to use my Magnum anytime soon. I love my Magnum, but just in case I find it's another weapon, not to mention there's a weapon or there's something. I do I open up that thing in the sewers? I don't even know, really. Oh, there you go. Door unlocked. I should look at this character. Natalia can see things that ordinary people don't see. Get smoke powder. Okay. Let's go, Natalia. Let's go. New area. I should have figured, because usually we go on detour paths to different places. I will get Mary to lift this for me so I can crawl under. Alright. Let's do the hunting. Oh, we're not alone. There's enemies down there. They're gonna come and they're gonna want to hurt us. Let's see. Uh, this is definitely where they are. This new sewer area. I feel like this is gonna collapse. Apparently, I was wrong, but it looked like it was somewhat bendy in the middle. The music's kicking in. There's something ahead. Be careful. 
I see those footprints. Let's do this. The actual, I guess, episode part of the episode begins. I'm not gonna try and trigger out those enemies, though. A dead end. Not as much as you think. Looks very. like we can open the sluice from higher up. I see one of those invisible insect things. But I'm not gonna get it yet. I'm gonna first see if these things are alive. Here's a test. Are you alive? You are not alive. Are you alive? You are not alive. Okay, neither of them are alive. It's also shiny. Let's pass that over to you. Now there is an invisible insect right there, if I can aim this correctly. I wasted that brick. Now they have two more bricks because I think they realized this one was in a tricky place. Now I'm not going out of my way to find these, but if I see one I can't help but try and hit it. I missed entirely. Got it. Pick up brick. Barry, there's a hole. You don't say. And there you go. See the other side our side shows off to us. Going up. There's something ahead. Be careful. I feel like all these things that are down are gonna get up at some point. Natalia, can you open the sluice from that side? Okay, hang on. Oh boy. Thankfully I'm pretty used to controlling Natalia, so. Sewage map. Let's open this. Oh, we're gonna have this sort of scenario where one of us is gonna be down below, one of us is gonna be the Overwatcher. <laughs> no, Natalia, it's not how it works. Gotta get it higher. Gotta get it higher. Hi. There we go. Good work, Natalia. Keep it up. I thought it was gonna legitimately close as soon as we got up. I guess these things are all just as dead as they look. Alright, so now I see where the search uh, area is. Got all journey between the two There's of them. There's something ahead. Be careful. Don't just assume that all bodies are dead. They're all gonna have to rise at some point. Oh. I don't have a brick. Barry, save me! I'm a good shot. <laughs> They're on top of each other. Anyways. Now let's get this open. See, it's all in part of the teamwork. Natalia's got this. That's a lot of bodies over there. Gate number three. Why not lift it? What is Barry gonna yeah, see? Besides a lot of zombies that I'm gonna try and knock. I expected you to come alive this part. All of them, in fact. Does that count as two kills? I grab as soon as you Toss it off, though, and knife what I can. Be rabbit animation. Okay, I gotta punch them. That's always part of the fun. Alright, so that's how I get to have some more of a running fun. Oh, I could have done that and killed them all like this. I see. <laughs> Barry on top of the thing. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Well, I could have closed off the area for Barry if I really wanted to. I see, they had an alternative strategy for me to deal with this. That's kind of nice. 
Oh, wait, no, am I going backwards? Okay. Never mind. I got a little bit tipsy turvy. Got all flipped around. Does that explain this? Okay, and not much there. On to the next area. Let's see. A lot of explosives to push down, so I will. No reason not to if I can. Got an herb, I'll try and hold on to that, thanks. Fairy, shoot this thing in my way. Okay. I say to myself. Gunpowder, smoke powder. Natalia, the sluice. <laughs> I'm aware, Barry. Is this thing gonna come alive? I'll move this in the way first. Will this thing rise as I start to mess with this? There's something over there. It's big enough that I could see it from here. What the? Oh, I didn't even see that. I guess I should have switched characters. Oh, that means I'm gonna have to go back a little bit, probably. That'll be a little bit annoying. Should have paid more attention to Barry. Oh, it's not that far back. <laughs> That's doable. Pick up this and that. Shoot that for Natalia. Push down the explosives for Barry, because who knows, maybe he'll need them for something. I don't know if he'll need them for something, but again, that's the very thing I do not know. There's also an item here, which I guess you last time. I didn't notice this before. Pick that up for Barry later. Can I switch it off to him? Yes, I can, even though we're not really directly next to each other, but hey, that works. Let's see. Twist check. All the things to push off. Just Barry. I don't know where these zombies came from. Alright, another achievement. I, I thought they came from the sluice, but I guess there was something else. I'll get Barry to stand up here so zombies can't get him so easily. Let's start opening. Actually, what is this thing over here? I saw something marching. Oh, it's a dog. Took me a moment. It's like, what is that? Oh, what's, it's not really a dog. I guess pigs in this, but it's really look like dogs. All the twists to go. Thankfully, Barry is not dying. He's just because of how I faced him, looking at me really creepily. All right, Barry's got this. Let's take a look down here. Empty bottle. Wow. Am I full? Oh, my pockets are actually full. Ah, uh, let's see. Gunpowder, pass. Smoke powder, pass. I pick up the bottle, and the bottle can combine with a few things. I guess I'll take the firebomb. Okay. I'll take care of the puppies, because I know I can take care of them. Oh, how'd she 
get out of the way from there. Don't want to waste ammo on these. I swear there was one more. Maybe I was imagining it. Topaz for the road and on to the next area. I'm not gonna let that zombie get Natalia. Oh, I did actually successfully pull off a headshot, which is not what I was actually expecting. Headshots for everyone! Yay! Here's another zombie. Can't wait for his daily headshot. Alcohol in a box with a topaz in it. And these sewers are sure gain a lot more. Oh wait, there's a zombie. Okay, let's see what Natalia's journey entails. Let's see if I can catch her up to speed here. Barry! Yep, I see. They're not the living dead, though. That's nice. Alright, combine this. I'll go. Smoke screen bottle. Do you have a lot of smoke powder? I'm gonna go for explosive right now, though. Pass that over. All oh, the switcheroos. Right, he's always not coming back alive immediately. No, I just should have figured. <laughs> All right, didn't want to waste that shot, but do what we do because we can. Back to use one of those boxes that you can open. This one's a three lock. That's good, just barely on the verge. How about here? There we go. All three locks got. Inside we'll find rare parts, of course. I know it's this way to go, I just want to go pick that up. All day long, I too will have good luck. Oh, Zambi. No worries, Barry. I'll be an obvious. Okay. All seems good there. There was an item in here, like I expected. Pass that over to Barry, because he needs his ammo. The little animation thing. It's about what I expected. Crawling zombies gonna be if I had a break that'd be so easy. Simple. All right, the down slope. That was indeed the right idea. Move this in the place. Now areas for me to cross over. See, I like this sequence. I actually do. I'm having fun with it. This is hanging ammo means more to pass on to you. I don't know where 
Natalia is going, but she's going somewhere, that's for certain. She's so whittled she can fit in the little sewer pipes. God. Barry, shoot this thing in my way. I can't get by. Barry, this one. It's getting closer. Oh. I didn't know that could be a thing. So smoke grenades can reveal them. Huh, that's interesting. Waste of ammo, not really. That's okay. Good to know that smoke can reveal those. Time for another one of these. Natalia, the sluice! Another successful headshot. Oh, they finally gave me a brick. I'll keep it here, though. Not gonna hit that. Scalp and it's for Barry. All the teamwork. Da -da 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 -da. There we go. Oh, this is a big open area. Suspiciously big and open even. Sounds like we're about to meet up because I saw one of those unlocked chests on um, her side. Can we just like drop down here? Nope. I guess it's too high for what? 10 year old? 12 maybe? Try and get her through here. Oh, there's a thing I can push down. I'll push it down. I can drop this rock to do that. There's something ahead. Be careful. I dropped my brick. That's not even what was causing me not to be able to push this. That's just the rock inside. Oh, there's explosive for me. I feel like something's gonna come bursting out. And that's what I've been doing all this for. Call it just this gut feeling. Before I do that, let's see how these things alive. At least one of them is. They're all alive, in fact. I'm even 
didn't realize there was one there. I know now that these can reveal all right well I did take care of that all the fun to put together Natalia, see if you can get this open. Got it. <laughs> she dropped her brick on top of that. Oh, I would have noticed that probably otherwise. Pass that over. Let's go crawl inside. I don't have my brick anymore. This is unfortunate. I have it now, though. Also alive. Yes. Barry's got the right idea. There's something ahead. Be careful. All right. Brick. Something else I could hit it with. This is a topaz. Now I can open this. See, life is okay, at least for the moment. All of the things to twist and turn. And da -de -da -de 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 -de. Duh, I'm Sluice Master. Harry, there's something over there. There I go. It's gone the mat way of me taking care of this. Are you still alive? I need your help. Only we can take care of this. That's one lock. So close. Let's try here. Again, so close. There's another one again, finally. And there you go, unlocked. The oh, it's Barry's thing. Let's manage back for Barry. Come with me. Coming. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Well, that's that. Let's get going. 